Hello and welcome to Sniper Elite 4. This is obviously a brand new series, and this will be almost entirely blind, and about as blind as a man can be because I've not played any of the first three Sniper Elites. So this is a completely new game series to me, and a completely new game on its own to me. So about as blind as a man can be. There's one small caveat on this, and that is that this is uh, my second go because I had played for an hour. You know, I, I did episode one, and then very shortly into episode two, I died, and I wanted to check to see if completing all missions without restarting to see if maybe that was a trophy, because that seems like something that could have been a trophy. So I, I looked up all the trophies, and there is actually one for completing it with no manual saves. And I had put a manual save in because I was having some struggles at the end of episode one, and so I wanted to go back to the shooting range. So I put a manual save in, but I didn't really need to do that. I could have easily just used the autosave they have. So I think it's better to just start this all over and go at it. Now I say I played you know an entire episode. That's that's not a lot for how slow I was going. Since we are completely blind here, I'm moving very very slowly. So that episode a world didn't feature war, a ton. A world in turmoil. We closed the trap on Hitler's North Africa campaign. But what next? Churchill urged an allied invasion of Italy. Called the Mediterranean the soft underbelly of the crocodile. The Americans took some convincing. But Winston won them over. General Dwight D. Eisenhower, Allied Commander-in-Chief, is masterminding the entire Mediterranean strategy. As for me, I'm headed for San Salini, a secluded island to Italy's southwest. We've been losing ships in the area. British intelligence thinks the Luftwaffe's presence on San Salini might explain why. The Royal Navy dispatched a captured Italian freighter, the Orchidia, to investigate. She was equipped with the very latest radio interception equipment. The intelligence she gathered confirmed our worst fears. The Nazis have a new wonder weapon. Survivors from the destroyed ships have talked about a new kind of missile. Radio controlled from the plane that launched them. These rockets can track our ships with lethal accuracy. The Orchidia's job was to monitor Luftwaffe radio transmissions and find out what the Germans are up to. Even if that meant making the ultimate sacrifice. Now we need to know what the Nazis are planning and how we can stop them. A member of the Luftwaffe's top brass is on the island, General Tobias Schmidt. It's no secret Hitler thinks highly of him. Schmidt would never let himself be taken alive, and he'd never betray his beloved Fuhrer. But he might just be carrying some information we can use. My mission? Kill Schmidt. Kill all high-ranking officers. And get the hell out. So luckily, you guys aren't going to get to see me struggle with the controls the way that I was in the real episode. Need to make sure those men didn't die in vain. Need to find out all I can about the new rocket. 
Yeah, there was about a five minute period right here where I was just messing around with all the controls. Uh, that's not gonna happen this time around. We're just gonna we're gonna head right in there, and I will I, I'll make note of where I was when we started this anew. So so the blind will start. Hopefully, uh, this episode. I, I'd like to think that since we're doing this again, I, I can go a bit faster. We'll see. So that's what I did first time. And what I actually did. Hold up. Let me uh, search. I think I've grabbed all I can. I think I ended up making this switch, but uh, we're not going to this time. But what I was doing, I, I didn't know if they could discover bodies, so I was tossing these into the ocean, and that was a good time, Just tossing these first few into the ocean. Alright, and then we wanted to look up here, where what I saw was this thing. But I never took a shot at it for some reason. I don't remember what exactly happened, but I didn't end up shooting that thing. Like, I saw this crane, I'm like, I bet I can shoot at that. And then the tag button, or the tag uh, prompt came up right there is this tag object, R2. And when it said fragile, I'm like, okay, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can shoot that thing. But. So what's the meterage on that? About 91 meters. So I spent a long time trying to figure out how to shoot. Like the wind, the wind meter there at the top center, and then the range adjustment down on the bottom right. Like I, I spent a good bit of time trying to understand all that. I think I've got no key grasp, but like I said, at, after. I put a stock to episode one, I went to the shooting rank, and I spent uh, not a long time there, maybe ten minutes, just really just understanding the mechanics. Like, I wasn't practicing my shot, per se, I was oh, just I'm trying to joking. understand the mana, the, the, the mechanics of how the range adjustment worked, and how the wind worked, and all that. And I think I got a decent grasp on it, but not... <laughs> Not good up. enough. When I came back and started shooting episode two, I, I was missing shots still. So, I, like, I'm not... I'm still not a great shot right now, but at least I understand how I'm supposed to take the shots. So I don't think I actually got that environment until the last time, like I said. This will come in very useful. I'm really wondering about a section coming up that I he just tossed him in the ocean. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that I really bungled the first time around. That that's what I'm really thinking about now. I, I ended up bungling it, and I had just a whole mess of enemies come up on me, and I ended up getting through it. I only had to use one med kit, but it was it was certainly not uh, an ideal scenario for me. There's actually a really nice moment that I'm going to regret not having in the playthrough, where I shot at a guy but missed him, and like, he kind of disappeared on me. And his friends were getting all worked up and moving around. I'm like, man, at some point, I'll show you the spot. Like, at some point, they're just going to come and get me. The tower looks like a good vantage point. So I switched to a close range weapon. And I walked over to this ladder right here. But I was in the tower. I was in the tower at the time. I was shooting out of this hole in the wall. And I just walked over here. And as soon as I got here, the guy was hitting the top of the ladder. And I just shot him point blank. 
it was just a, a beautiful moment of anticipating what they would want to do to me. I thought there was... Do I already have it? Yeah. Uh, see, I, I got a sniper report up here. I did not know that uh, I wouldn't have to get that again. That's, that's unfortunate. I would have liked to have to do that again, believe it or not. Okay, so what we need to do here is a fellow down at the camp. Probably not the guy we open against. There was this one fellow, if I can locate him again. He was over this way. Yeah, this is what Let's we were looking camera. at. This camera, this enemy. That's what we were looking at. So, what's his range? About 62. So we're going to put this at 100. It's going to jump up just a touch. The wind's crazy here, but... Do we care that much about wind at 100 meters? I'm never really sure. Yeah. I wish I was a little bit more confident. But this should be fine right here, right? I feel pretty good about that. If the wind... See, the wind... Maybe it doesn't matter as much as I think it does. At least not at 100 meters, it doesn't seem like but yeah, that's what we... That's Peter Hmm, cool. But they're not shooting at me right now. The last time they were shooting at me while I was up here? Well, that sounded like a shot. And so I thought... They, they know where I am, of course. I should just... Make sure they're not gonna... Come up with me. Keeping your distance trophy. Fantastic. Shot, nice. Okay, so I am getting better here. The, the wind is still a factor. Like, I thought I, I thought I would always have to adjust to the wind, but apparently at this range you don't really have to do that. That's just something for longer ranges, which is fine. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm shooting a lot better this time. Oh, okay. They're aware of me now. There's something I've, I have figured out at this point, but I haven't actually had a chance to do it. And that is that... Hmm. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, when the planes fly overhead, that would be the time to shoot, because then they wouldn't hear the shot. That's something I've kind of discovered, but haven't actually done it yet. Grenade shot. Uh, completely accidental. I'm, I'm not, not afraid to... Uh, whoa, whoa, shit! Shit, 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 shit. Not afraid to admit that that was an accidental bit of luck right there. Headshot. I also spent a decent amount of time on the first mission uh, not realizing that I don't auto heal. <laughs> I don't play a lot of games this style, but I know the ones I have played. Uh, you, ju you just heal up over time, you know? And that's what I was expecting here. But no, I, I had I had that red on my screen for at least three minutes before I realized. Oh no, I actually have to use the medkit in my hand. 
Can't find anything else. So this is going significantly better than last time. But I actually did this last time without taking damage. And I had a lot more enemies dead at the end of it. It wasn't the cleanest. But in the end, you know, they were all dead. I wasn't. So maybe I did better last time, even though it wasn't quite as neat. Not sure. That, oh, fucking hell. I got 150. Can I make that shot? If I can make this shot. Let's actually bump that up to 200. If I can make this shot. Actually, is that a explosive right there? It looks like it might be. It is. Hello. Ghost. Of course, I didn't wait for the damn plane. I don't know why that's something I'm completely failing to do each time. I adjusted a little bit for the wind there. Maybe not enough, maybe too much. I'm not really sure. It's one thing I mentioned that was bothering me, and it's just that I don't I don't exactly know where these misses are missing, so I don't know how to adjust. Yes, just judging by this right here, we are, again, like, I, I don't know, I don't know how I missed that. Not, not that I don't know how I missed it. Uh, <laughs> when I say I don't know how I missed it, it, so it sounds like I felt like I should have hit that. Uh, that's not necessarily the case. I, I'm not thinking that, yes, I should have gotten that shot. Obviously, I wouldn't have taken it if I didn't think I could have gotten it, but... I'm more saying, I don't know if I missed it left or right. And so I don't know how to take the next shot. Oh, oh, wrong button, wrong button. Come on, guys. See one of them. I could. This damn fence is being problematic. God damn it. That's that's something I gotta stop doing. I don't know why I think R1 is tag. There's really not a good reason to think that. All right, all right, all right. Hold up. Stop, dude. All right. Jerry can 131. So put this at 100. Get just above it. And then account a little bit for the wind. Not much, just a touch. I right, should be able to use that. But we're waiting for him to come back here. Okay. Alright, that's fine too. That's fine too. Got it. Nice. Alright, we're doing okay. I think this is one of the generals too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we got the damn officer. Great. So we had him killed before I started over. But I did not kill him from range like that. I, I was right up on him. I was actually in that barn when I killed him. 
Yes, yeah, so there was like a 10 meter kill. That was much cleaner this time around. Oh, hello. No, no, cancel. No, stop. Alright, where you at? I see you, son of a bitch. Get the fuck out of my house. There we go. Am I still over the left shoulder? Switch that. No, switch. I was over the left shoulder for a specific reason. He's moving near that jerry can. But I can't see it from here. I gotta adjust. I spent some time up in that little tower there. That, that's where I figured out the whole thing. The planes? Because there's a generator over there that you can kick to make it much louder. And that same icon that shows when there's a plane flying overhead, I'll, I'll point it out. Myself. That icon uh, showed up again, and so I'm like, okay. Is he down in that valley? Yeah, let's. He might be down in there. Because I don't think he can really get to me. Oh god! Where? Where? Why am I not dead? Last time I died it was from one shot. Triple fucking kill. Oh fuck me. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, relax. Relax. Okay. Oh fuck. Okay, yeah, last time I died, it was from one shot. So I don't know how the fuck I just survived that. Oh my gosh. No more to find here. Where? Oh. No! No, 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 no reload! Not right now. Not the time. Man, I really thought I could just tear through those two. That did not happen. <laughs> okay, okay, relax. Relax. Nothing else. This is the sort of thing. Like, having those three come up the hill and having these two come up behind me like that. That's the sort of thing that was happening at that tower on the first playthrough. So you're getting sort of the same experience, except this is a lot more precarious. When I was at that tower, I at least had a decent amount of cover, and they, I had a choke point that they could only get to me from. Here I am out in the open, and this is very frightening to me. So I'm going to try... I everything useful. Try to reset the situation the best I can. Yeah, I never went down into that beachy area the last time. I went straight up to that barn. 130, okay. So at 100, it's going to jump a little bit. Oh, don't go in there. I'm going to jump just a touch and drop. drop. The wind is not really affecting. Oh, he slowed down. Am I missing him? I feel like I'm missing him. There I am. There we go. Just took me and take me five fucking shots. Alright, so yeah, yeah, we definitely have to account for that wind. Uh, 
<laughs> not, not nearly as much at shorter distances, which of course makes perfect sense. So we got the beach. Do we want to go down the beach or not? I'm thinking we might just yet not do it. By the way, episode one actually ended. I was up in that tower shooting down. I was just, there was a guy, I think it might have been that guy just patrolling back and forth, and I was just taking shots at him, trying to figure out the scope. But I guess because I had that generator disabled, like he never heard the shots. So I was just able to just sit there and shoot at him, and I, I must have shot 20 his way. See, I'm I'm still not a good shot. Fanny stretch, but I think I'm a lot closer than I was. Another thing I'm going to miss about not having the real first episode, which I I might actually leave up as like just test run or something, but the decision to do this on hardcore was was made in the moment. Like I was just looking at the difficulties. I'm like, eh, you know, fuck it. And I just you know, that was exactly that's exactly how it went. Except it was more genuine. Like you know what, fuck it. And uh, we did it. Fuck you. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. How did I miss that? That was. That's not, did I miss a left or right? That is, how could I be such a bad shot that I fucked that up? Trying to control my breathing here. Pop it in and out. Nope, relax. It's a little low, okay. that off. Oh, not the time. Not the time, brother. There's still another one. Stop. Stop reloading. Nice. Oh, I thought that was a headshot. this up. We're gonna need to reload very soon. Oh. And that's probably gonna lead to us dying. Alright, now we're getting sloppy. 
Now we're getting sloppy. Okay, there were a lot of... I only had to use one medikit last time. So you can see the way... Even playing for a little while, you can see how much... Uh, my, my caution has gone out the window. There were a lot of medkits I had found. Ooh, that's that's the one I had switched to. Yeah, it's just better. But all right. Oh yeah, I I found a lot of medkits. So I think I can get that restocked. We don't have any on us right now. Can't find anything else. Oh, behind me again. Might have guessed. Are their helmets really that fucking effective? I guess they wouldn't really use them if they weren't. Bleed out, okay. Guess I grabbed everything useful. Okay. Guess I'm missing from down and run out. If you had grenades on them, why can't I have those? I probably have. I only got two. I think I can carry a third. Um. Has a med kit. I didn't really point this out at the time, but when I exploded that truck, That's there was a propaganda camera near it. I, I mentioned. Yeah, we can destroy the camera and destroy the guy inside the camera. But, I didn't really mention that that is a secondary objective here. There's supposed to be three of those things. That's the only one I have found. So, we are still on the lookout at this point for... Two more of those cameras. Medkit. That's two. I think I had three at one point. So we can still look for another one. So let's for the moment get up to that. Get up to that barn. And as mentioned, this barn is where I died. And so where the first playthrough ended. So let's go get this officer. Who I have not searched to this point. I don't know if he'll have anything or not. But if he does... Nothing else. It, it's certainly something I don't know about. So... Let's search. Oh, trophy. Got a duty. Got a duty thing on it. So, again, if we look at optional objectives down the bottom right... There are four duty rosters. I'm guessing one on each officer? So yes, I was in this barn. I saw this ladder went up. And then as I was climbing, I heard voices. And when I turned around, the officer was talking to somebody down there. So I shot him, but then... 
and third guy showed up and killed me in one hit. So that was where that ended, because I had had a manual save. Last left, family comes in. This will right. come in very useful. So if we want those, corpse searching is the way to do it. Okay, we're gonna go in this house. So at this point we are blind. Uh, I have not been in this house, and I have not been further down that way. So we are blind again, and there's one of those letters that I've picked up before, so we're going to add to our collection right here. Okay. Letter addressed to Lieutenant Hans Agapur. It looks like we actually can't go inside, which is interesting. Okay, so no, not going inside this place. These spouts over here. Like, I, I feel like I should be able to climb those, but I haven't yet found a way to do it, so. Let's mark this gentleman who I see. Oh, come on. There. You. 95 meters. So that's close enough that we can just put this at 100. And we should just be able to give the barest of adjustments for wind. Just need to get the damn angle where he's not standing in front of that damn post. And you should be alright. And sure my plane overhead would have been nice. But I was not prepared for it. So we're gonna settle down a little bit. That guy doesn't have a helmet. Let the heartbeat uh, slow down. Hoping for another plane. I don't, I don't know how often they are. How often they are? How frequent they are, I guess would have been the better way to say that. Okay. I don't know if they realize where that shot came from or not. I hope they don't. That radar on the top right, that shows up for going for a while. I don't really know what it means. Yes, that means you're not a radar. Say it, baby. I don't know that. I don't know how well I got him. I don't know if we'll get a bleed out from that, but we definitely got a hit. And this guy appears to be taking cover with his back to me, which is nice. That means they definitely don't know where the hell I am. Which is exactly what I want to know. I shot. Oh, baby. Alright, yeah, I'm definitely getting better. Okay, get your reload now. Let's 
C2 way down there. But I'm concerned about the Uh, like I said, I don't I don't know if they know I'm here or not. I well obviously they know somebody's here but because they know here exactly, do they know this exact spot? Is what I'm saying. So I don't know how cautious I need to be. There's that beach. One hit kill. Baby! Liver? Yep. This is good. I, I enjoy uh, when I've got this distance between me and them. That's, that's good. Is that his hand? It almost looked like I shot the hand that was holding the gun. Oh, get wrecked. <laughs> is that a lung? Yes, that is a lung. Alright. Again, I still, I still feel like I'm not aware of it, my location. Maybe I'm being excessively optimistic right now, but I just don't, I don't see it. I don't, I don't see them reacting in a way that suggests they know exactly. That. Get me correct? <laughs> oh man, raining down the deck. Good. I'm really, really pleased with how well I'm doing. I probably will try to keep that episode up as a test episode, just so you can see like, how much of a change there is between this episode and that. He's not getting back up. Should I should take another shot just to make sure he's done? Yes. That was a hit. I saw this blood, but... I have not gotten a notica notification that he's died yet. What's this guy up to? That guy's just walking around like he doesn't even know something's going on. Plane is going over their heads. This guy down here. I swear I just saw one. Hmm. Yeah, it's right there. Right there. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. Let's hit a reload. And let's sort of just reassess our situation here. Yeah. I think we might have might have exhausted that spot. Let's actually hit this beach. We never went to the beach. Let's do that. No more to find here. I guess my plan are those, so that was well worth the search. here so this this little cautious movement here is is more what you should expect hmm got ourselves a cave See what we found in here. This little ammo stash, nice. Think I've grabbed all I can. Got some 
some rifle ammunition. Here's the idiot. Alright. A little more bold with my movements right now. I've only got about 13 minutes left. I've gotten back to the point where we are playing completely blind right now, so... I'm happy with that. I'm really happy with this first episode. Uh, at the moment, my thought is to put the... Um, original first episode as an unlisted video. Just in case I ever want to bring that out. And that would probably just be by popular demand. If if a few comments ask for it, I'll probably put it up as you know trial run or prelude or something. With a qualification that's not part of the main playthrough, but it is part of the series. I guess we could say. Hide spots here, but if I get in trouble, I'm going to sneeze. I'm going to go out. Not finding anybody down here is, is really disappointing. Uh, because. A lot of inaction. You know. And I have to. Lose my patience all the damn time. Just run around like this. I want to be quiet and stuff, but well, I haven't done anything with. Hmm, that's probably worthwhile. Is that just my pistol? Yeah, there it is. I believe it is. How's it going to be? Oh, booby traps. I haven't done anything with like setting up booby traps or tripwire mines or anything like that. So I'm not exactly sure. I, I know how to booby trap a body. I, I saw you just press R1 to do that. But... Beyond that, I, I have no idea how to set up like trip wires and, and those sorts of things. Six, completely passive. Almost too easy. And then I miss them. Then I miss them wildly and look like a fool. Look like a damn fool. Absolute fool. So now he's alive. He knows I'm here. Oh god! Don't fucking panic like that. Take a minute, line it up. Just spraying it around him. It, it doesn't seem like that phases them. If that made him a little nervous, then maybe that's worthwhile to do, but... No, he was not phased. Another last Nothing slider. Else right. find. Cool. Thompson... Oh! Magazine size goes down, but damage goes up. And the rate of fire goes down as well. That's an interesting... Choice. I'm gonna stay with what I have. I mean, that's not something I'm copying. Hoping that guy was the guy I'd shot. He just ended up behind me. 
but I'm not sure about it, of course. Okay. <clears throat> Eight minutes now. On the timer. Might be enough to get through this beach area. Sound mask. That's the first sound mask shot I have done. I'm pretty sure. I had sound mask with that generator, but I never hit anything. So, yeah, that's the first of that. And that's cool. That is cool. Through his dang helmet, which makes me think. Did I not? I want to search him. I'm pretty sure I didn't. But they're not giving me that option. So he's just got nothing on him. That's a way up. We might take that or we might go around the other way. I'm not sure. That looks like a camera though. Or is that a, a motor? An outboard motor. Yep, that's an outboard motor. Okay. Is that a guy? That's a guy. Hello, guy. Oh, get ready. shotgun ammo, but I don't carry a shotgun. I had to check. Maybe I actually did carry a shotgun. What is that? Oh, rock. The rocks. Okay. Didn't even know that. That's a guy. I thought. I thought I just saw a guy right there. Whatever that is. There's a fence. I swear I got saw a fucking guy up there. All right, let's. Do I want to climb up that wall? Probably not. I probably want to go around the other way and try it like that. Uh, I might check that wall just to see if there's maybe a black one. Hey. Oh, I saw it. Search body was an option. I just saw it. I swear to God. I swear to God. Pick it up. Toss it. <laughs> Maybe now we can search him? Hmm? No. no. I know the option was there though. I definitely I definitely saw it. For a moment. Ooh, guy, right there. That sound happening here, but it's weeds I can't get LOS. So we're not going to take this shot right now. Looks like he's got a friend up there too. Or maybe we will. Mm. Fuck! Who needs sound dabbling? Fuck him, fuck his friend. I don't give a fuck at all. Come on, guy. Where's friend? Hey, there he is. Hello. Hello, friend. Correct.
makes me so nervous every time it pops up. I think it's trying to tell me something, but I haven't quite translated it. It seems like there should be a guy right over there. According to the way I read that radar. It might just be like I'm putting way too much in, into it. Oh, guy right there. Oh, guy. Can't find anything else. Cool. Uh, what was that? Um, where can I? No, not here. Here. Uh, oh, clearing the checkpoint. Okay. Yeah, I I remember reading that that was an objective, but I did not know where the checkpoint was. Oh, we found it. Whoopsie. <laughs> Almost done. Right, yeah, let's go up this way. Just to see what we can see. Come on. Checking all these off people. So yeah, just like that. Okay. Yeah, we can find some sure high ground. Whoop. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Stay up there, please. Okay. All right, fellows. I see fellows. Hold on. Right, you tag. 137, not as far as I would have thought that to be. So, right about there. That's a hit. Yeah, definitely got significantly better. Grenade shot. Oh, the poor man. The poor man from 137. Yeah, I see you. This guy. Well, now it's multiple guys. Yeah. Hit him. Alright, there's my timer. So here, right in the middle of the action, I unfortunately have to cut this video. I'll be back in a moment.